it's Cindy from Cesar Chavez Central Library and I'm here to bring you a craft. Today we are going to be bleaching shirts with stencils. So the supplies you're going to need are gloves, some bleach in a spray bottle. What I like to do is dilute it with some water so it's just equal parts, equal parts bleach, equal parts water. And then I use for my stencil freezer paper. Once you cut out your stencil, you then iron it onto your shirt. But the way to iron it is by putting the shiny side down onto the shirt. You set it at a cotton setting, press it onto the shirt, let it cool down. And then you take your shirt outside. It has to be a 100% cotton t-shirt for it to work. You take your bleach, your bottle, and then you just start to lightly spray around your image. Don't saturate it, otherwise you won't get a clean image. Then we just wait for the magic to happen. It'll take about 15 minutes for it to dry. We'll come back when that's all done. See you in a few minutes. All right, we're back. Now, the second part of this project is when you remove the stencil. So zoom in camera person. What you do is you just slowly lift the freezer paper off because we've already hit it with bleach. It should come off pretty easy. Just kind of slowly lift it, lift it, lift it. And then as you can see, the image stayed behind and you have a really cool dragon. So there you go. Real simple, real fun, real easy. You don't require a lot of supplies. One thing I did forget to mention, and this is basically a, um, a preference. You can put cardboard in between the shirt so that it doesn't bleed through the back. I usually don't. And just to give you an idea, this is kind of what happened. Um, it's not a big deal. You could just you know spray more on there to get a little design. Um, super quick, super easy, lots of fun. You can use any shape you want. Like I said, it's just freezer paper, bleach, and 100% cotton shirt, and you have something fun to wear. Thanks for joining me.